So yeah, it's really unfortunate. I think, you know, combat sports is a risk. It's, I think, um, a lot of, it tends to attract a lot of, uh, younger population. So they are a little less aware of the dangers involved in the sport. So they just think like, Oh, well, I'm going to go, I'm going to slug it out, you know, win a belt and everything. And it's all good. Maybe I'll get a little lumps and it's, it's nothing major, but, um, there's legitimate risks involved, right? People do like, uh, get brain bleeds, right? So, so that's what happens with some fighters where, you know, they get, um, knocked out. And also never bring a brain bleed, and then you know that causes a big problem. Um, they are doing dangerous weight cuts. I've spoken to a number of athletes. They even rolled in athletes like that, where um, you know, they'll tell me, "It's like, yeah, I'm fighting a month, and uh, it's 20 pounds under, and I'm going to lose 10 pounds in a month, and I'll cut the water for the rest." And they really have no structured plan about how to do. It.